Good evening and welcome back to World of Tanks. It's Jager262 and I'm doing my second black market video for today. I just wanted to first apologize for the late upload. I tried to do just a picture post just to my channel to let you guys know what was going on at 8 but for whatever reason only up let me upload videos. I didn't actually end up recording a video because I was doing or preparing dinner at the time. I had a late evening and so I got on right at 8, bought this and then just moved on. So it's already been sold out. Obviously this is hours later and I apologize to anybody who didn't get it or didn't know it was out. But for everybody who did, as always, talk about it in the comments section below. I'd love to hear your thoughts on the vehicle. I've never played the T-34, but I did want the T-34B back in, I believe, 2017 is when this vehicle was first released as part of the Black Friday specials. It's, ba it's just a T-34 but comes in black instead of olive green and I had done 90% of that but I was in college at the time and so we were doing finals and everything so I didn't complete it and they did give everybody like a 75% discount on it depending on how far you had made it but I missed the discount window so I never got it and so while I might not be get, getting the IS6 I definitely wanted the T34 and so I bought it really quick I believe it sold for 8.5 million credits which is actually 500,000 less than the Centurion, or sorry, not the Centurion, the Canarvan Action X, and that's because this is not that rare of a vehicle in and of itself, and I'll do maybe a mini run through the stats. Again, the only thing that makes it special is the fact that it's black. Other than that, it's your standard T-34. It's a very good, very strong, and highly mobile American heavy tank, and I've always won it once, so I knew I was going to buy it, and again, I'll probably pass on the IS-6. But good news is, is that we'll probably see the IS-6 if you guys didn't get this one, if you missed it, or if you're holding out for the IS-6. I'm predicting for tomorrow, I mean it could be any of the next three days that this event's running for, but I'm pretty sure we'll see it tomorrow. And I'm still waiting on, and I know a couple of other guys who have been talking to me in the comments are waiting for the Falk 155, so hopefully we'll get to see those real soon. But this was a pretty okay deal. I'm kind of happy with it. Uh, if you missed it, again, if you have the normal T-34, you're really not missing out. No joke, it is just the same, and I'll run through the stats to show you. 400 average damage with 1,600 DPM, 4 rounds a minute, 1,500 hit points, 102 frontal armor, 279 turret armor up here. It's straight up just a T-34 heavy black and this is what it looks like so if you really are a collector and you really like the T-34 and you missed out on this that's unfortunate but it's really just a paint job I didn't have the normal T-34 and again I was part of that event so that's why I personally picked it up but don't feel bad if you missed out there are other more special vehicles coming if you did get this or if you already had the T-34 Again, let me know down below, and I'm always happy to talk to you guys about this stuff. And that's pretty much it. Shorter video. Again, I'm sorry it's so late, but I couldn't get that post out, so this is pretty much it. I'm going to do... This will probably be the last one I do a review on, because it's already been done a bunch. But I'll do the Hydro, the Canarvan, this, and hopefully I'm looking forward to the Falk. So, we'll see how it goes. Please give this video a like if you really enjoyed it, and subscribe if you want notifications for any other of my black market videos. If you've been watching and following with me, just get notifications on those or to get notifications on the reviews to come. Always appreciate the support, and thank you, thank you, thank you. I know I say that a bunch of times in every video, but it really means a lot to me to have this much engagement with the community over the past few days because of this event, and I really do appreciate it. So thank you for watching, as always. I'll see you next time.